So this is the state of the shed at the moment. It's a work in progress, but that's another subject. So basically I've got uh, my MC, that's my Vita MC. At the moment, that's my go-to bag. It's nice, compact, small enough to carry around. I'll normally take that if I'm not doing large works or need big tools and I'll work out what I need. If I need anything bigger, I'll usually go to Tech Pack. It's another Vito Tech Pack. All my bags are Vito. Um, it's either that or... Last one is the Tech XL. So that's got a lot of my larger bits and pieces, which I don't use too often. Files, drill bits, uh, reciprocating saw. Uh, what else have we got? Uh, that's for pot rivets and bits and pieces on the other side. And then I've got my Milwaukee pack out. So that's always ready to go. You can see I've labeled them on the front. So this week I'm doing a bit of AV and I might need some little bits of AV gear. So I normally just take that off and take that with me. The rest is just sort of screws. In this one we've got just data jacks, that sort of stuff. I won't need that. But um, yeah, so I'll be taking that one. And yeah, basically I pull apart my MC, as you can see, pretty started taking everything out on that side. So this side is the larger side. Normally I put um, my drills. I've just got the Milwaukee 12 volt range. I've got the 18 volt, but I mainly use the 12 volt for AV stuff. So that'll go in there. And then the other side here, it's just little bits and pieces. Usually things that come in handy. Got your Allen keys, scissors. Um, you got the Weir with the interchangeable heads. That's always handy, just in case for getting in certain spots. Level, we are screwdrivers, we are screwdrivers. Right angle bit, Nipex, wrench there, and a few other bits and pieces. All right, so this is my go-to pouch at the moment. This is the uh, MP1, Vito MP1. Take you through that quickly. Got a magnet on the side. Usually I put my screws on that, use that to find studs, metal studs. So we've got that. Get some stuff off that. On this side, I've got a couple of my bit holders. That's the Makita one. They're the really strong, good quality ones. We've got two of the cheap eBay ones. One's still going, the other one's uh, pretty much broken. So I won't be getting those again. Stick with the Makita ones. We've got my picker pencil. Always have that on me, always ready to go. My Weha Pico finish, got a Phillips and a Flatty. My Weera screwdrivers, same thing, they're just the larger. Channel lock pliers, always good. On this side, I've just got a little cheap pair of eBay needle nose they've come in handy a lot um, where's my and then usually I carry the brand new Nipex flash cuts that I got recently they just sit down the side here and then I've also been throwing that in that's the Nipex ergo strip that's for stripping cables um, still got to do a video on that one but that sits in there at the moment that locks in it's there next to my fluke bolt stick. Always got, got that on me. So that's that. So a couple of other things I'll be putting in. We'll be doing a lot of data probably. So I put that one in. That's for um, a lot of Comscope Cat 6A jacks. So I'll throw that in there. Same thing with that. More jacks. Never know what we're going to do. So I might throw that in the front there. Starting to get a bit tight. And then more jacks. Pan jute, male, female. Throw those in the side there. That's probably about it for that side. There 
there you go. Right there, I've got my, uh, that's my measuring device, laser. Basically tells you the distance, really good, really handy, that just sits in there. Go to the other side. What I've got is the M12 drill, M12 impact. So I'll throw those back in there. Um, throw that in there. A couple of batteries. Got a four amper, all charged up. Two batteries. Tape measure. Always go on the Fat Max. I don't think I'll leave that. I tried the uh, new Crescent, but um, gone back to the Fat Max. I can go on the side there. Like that. All right, and that's about it. Those are up. Nice and easy, she's fully packed, but um, really compact, way to go. What I usually do as well, this has a little clip on the back, that just slips in there, that way it goes with you wherever you go.